Welcome back to a new video. This video we're actually gonna start here at the goat place and all the ice is melted, all the snow is melted and I want to suck this water out. So hopefully my submergible dirt mud pump is gonna suck this out and hopefully I have a good enough pipe to reach it till there and it can push it up because I couldn't find a pipe long enough. The, all the garden pipes for some reason were sold out so all I have is this kind of a big fat pipe. Uh, it was really cheap, it was way cheaper than any garden pipe, but it's a bit fat, so I don't know if this pump can actually put the pressure to put the water out. So let's actually just try it, and then we're gonna move on to some other jobs. Let's get started. Yeah. So it does work, we tried it and we didn't want to unroll it and you know it doesn't it's not able to push the pipe and it's all getting stuck. And then we have to roll it up again. Yeah, then we have to just roll it up and leave it. But it does work perfectly fine. Just eat everything. Do you want to get a shower? It's a free shower machine. Max, stop pulling. Maxi, no biting. Maxi. Fifty meters of this pipe costed twenty euros. It's a bit more than. I mean, I, I calculated it and it should be 50, but it's a bit more, but uh, the mean, pipe is too much. It's better to have a bit longer, I guess, for other purposes. Yeah, of course. But that's really cheap. I wouldn't think that that type of pipe would be so cheap. Yeah, that like, feels like the expensive pipe, you know? Yes. Wow, that's a lot of pressure. That's a lot of pressure. It's very silent for a pump. Very silent. We're gonna go now feed the goats. 
because they actually are really interested in the pipe and this bad boy Max is trying to actually bite the pipe he's the only one that has any interest in it but he's trying to actually bite it so if he bites it open then you know the pipe is yes, broken so so we oh, have to feed them we have to keep them away from there yeah Maxi bad, bad boy That was enough fun. It was a little bit of, you know, try to do it and it looked like it wasn't so muddy. Yesterday it was frozen, we should have done it then. The ground maybe wouldn't sink so much. But yeah, it's uh, stuck now fully. So uh, we buried it in and we'll need to get the tractor to get it out again. But that's okay, we'll do it whenever the tractor's alive. This is not our main car, don't worry, we're not playing around here. Our car is sitting in the front where the ground is a bit more solid. But yes, uh, we have a lot more jobs to do today, so let's get going. So I think it's finished, I don't think it's gonna suck anymore. It's leaking back now uh, because, uh, you know, at some point the pipe has to leak everything back in. It cannot push nothing up, so it doesn't suck air. So we're just gonna bring it now, try to bring it at least to the ditch that's behind the goat house that's full. See if we can empty that because that's also, you know, a big cause of the water. Okay, let's see how much we're missing. So we're missing like four meters. <sighs> let's see what we can figure out. Yeah. Okay, let's see if that works. to bend that up. It's working! <laughs> That's a lot of water comes out. So according to the specs of the device, the pump should pump 14,000 liters in one hour. So it means that that uh, ditch there was around 20 to 25,000 liters. That's Quite a lot, lot of water. <laughs> some things for the tractor to be able to lift it up and move move the front away from the back it's gonna be a really tough job but we have to get this done yeah. our neighbors helped us out with giving us this self-made trolley with the cool tool that he used for lifting up his tractor so it's we already can, tested yes five times he has done it so, okay, so he knows. it should work perfectly fine and that's for the wheels not to sink into the ground okay. hopefully it works while we're waiting for the water to pump out we're gonna do one pallet of these wooden briquettes that we get delivered 
We have to get them in so they don't get too wet and expand and break. So we're just gonna get them in under the roof now. Yeah, it's gonna be a ton of work. It's a lot of work. It's, it's a full ton. It's literally a ton of work. Let's do the other pallet of the bricket, wood bricket, till this finishes. I don't think it's gonna finish today, but at least it's gonna get it lower so all the moisture can leak yeah. into here and not to be so muddy there. We already did the field, so that's gonna help a lot for the house, and now we did this. And anytime it fills up again, we can suck it out. I think next spring we can clean out the pipes because the water levels need to be low, and of course the ground needs to be hard for the equipment to drive in because it's like a truck that drives in and then they put giant pipes in to clean out the pipe that goes from here to the ditch. Yeah, but so, they told us we need to empty it before they can do it, they don't yeah. empty. So. That first of all, and of course they need to drive up to yeah, the location. Yeah, it's impossible now. They could not do it, the car does not move a single bit in here. So, uh, so that's going to be in the spring, but till spring we can just use the pump and suck it out. That's pretty fast, so yeah, not a problem at all. In a day it sucks it out like no problem, not in a day, in a few hours. I'm going to set it up for summer for the garden. So we can water up the garden, so it's going to be multi-use. Yeah, it's not perfect. just this, it's not its own purpose, only purpose. Had a bit of an accident, the pipe fell off and flooded back. Mm. I have a lot of water brought back. Yeah, it will. We'll see how it looks tomorrow morning. So that's it. We have taken out the pipe, we have brought in the briquettes, we have done all of today's jobs. It's not that late, but it's you know pitch black because it's winter, we get really dark very early. But yes, everything is done, and tomorrow we're gonna actually show you how it looks like how much we have emptied. And we have one more ditch to empty, one more like a fill up on Probably, the field. Yeah. We're gonna empty that one as well into the ditch so everything you know has little water so nothing you know like leaks over or leaks to the new the place we just emptied. So yes, that's pretty much it. Hope you enjoyed. We're gonna see you next time. Tomorrow. We need to go rest. Yeah, tomorrow. Yeah. Bye bye. Yeah, because now it's too dark to show you anything. <laughs> Way too dark. <laughs>